Have you considered at all, I know you've got the technical board now, adding a director of football, you know, one name that fans have asked us about is whether or not someone like Dave Bassett, for example, would take on a, on a role like that. Is there anybody who you would consider sort of employing in, in that particular position? Um, I mean, director of football mm. is uh, uh, a confusing title. Uh, we need first and foremost someone who can handle player recruitment and thereafter player contracts, the ins and outs of players, to ensure that we're getting contracts in place for well-selected players that uh, have the right monetary level of remuneration, i.e. more League One with bonuses if we get to the Championship et al. Maybe in the past we've been a bit weak on that and that's cost us dearly. Um, I think in, in a sense a technical board itself which will consist of an owner representative or representatives, a head of football administration, the ins and outs of uh, dealing with player issues, player contracts, uh, the team manager quite obviously supported as, as he may think fit through his recruitment uh, guy and then the academy manager I think is the other very important one so that the academy manager has a very big voice on that technical board to say well you know, if you're thinking of, of buying Rob as a left full back, why don't you look at Tom as yeah, a left full? I would not advise that. Yeah, <laughs> but you know, I mean, it's so. So there's more voice around the table, so that things aren't ignored in probably the same way that may have happened in the past, through the the board that was selecting players not being experienced enough. That's probably why you mentioned football director. Mm -hmm. If you've got actually four or five people representing the various parts, component parts of the football division of the football club, you don't necessarily need a football director. And you know, if you have, if if and that those people should be constant and should be at these meetings which are held regularly. I mean, Dave Bassett, love it. I spoke to Dave yesterday. He's delighted that Chris Wilder is joining us. He's, you know, I can't express the way he'd express it to you, Rob, because he's, you know, <laughs> you can imagine, can imagine the language, the language he was using to say what a great great appointment. Mm. Mm. But he was delighted. He knows we've got a manager that's on the way up. He knows he's good. We've got a manager that understands this club and the expectations of us all, but none more so than the supporters. He knows he's, that we've appointed a manager who can handle uh, pressure and hopefully bring us that success. Mm -hmm.